adventure. Like, share, subscribe, and click the bell, please. Thank you. I love you. I love you. We need money. <laughs>、right, guys. This is my friend. I can't remember his name. He comes by to eat cookies and doggy biscuits I get for him. He's the landlord's dog, and don't mind his rough appearance because the poor fellow's about 14 years old, and he roams around out here. Stays in the gate at night, over here, behind the fence, and the landlord sees I like him, and I talk to him and give him snacks. And you notice how he's protecting me. He's got his back to me, and he's watching the road, and that's telling me if somebody comes up here. Stops like this gentleman walking by right now. <clears throat> Hello, my friend. Hello, my friend. If he comes up here, this dog might bite him. Have a good day, my friend. Yeah. See you later. And you see him watching him, and he's gonna watch him till he walks away. Oh hell! He just dropped his bag. Right here in front of the house. Oh my God! Bag of piggy food. Oh my God! Hold on a minute. Have a good day, my friend. I had to think fast there for a minute. He dropped his piggy food. I'm doing a vlog, and、uh, I didn't want it to get hit by oncoming traffic because <coughs> it would have ruined the、uh, food. But anyway. I'm gonna cut this off for a minute. Okay, I had a friend of mine want to see where I lived. Wanted to see my new apartment, and this is the Gong Gong store.、And、there's the store. There's the still doors to the store. We we haven't opened reopened the store yet. We're going to. But this is my front porch, and、uh, the little coconut trees in the picture I was showing y'all. That's the、uh, gate to my landlord's property and house. And this is my view, with the occasional traffic. And this is the side yard, and the other side looks the same. So, this is my apartment. Let's go in and check it out. Got the roll-up door. I roll up at night or during the day, and I close it at night. Roll it down, steel door, and I have this double lock here with the gate, as you can see. And I can put the padlock on it. If I just want to sit here and feel safe, I can just put myself in jail. Okay, this is my refrigerator I bought. And they're secondhand. But it's not a bad little refrigerator. It works quite well. And new fan. 
my favorite chair. It pulls out into a cot. I think it's cool. I like sitting here because the, uh, the Wi-Fi right here is a lot better than any other place in the room here because of the steel roof. And of course we have some Japanese, Chinese pictures, I'm not sure. Maybe Chinese, maybe Japanese. It's, uh, it's, it's wood and mother of pearl. Very nice. Okay, we have the guest bunk here with the pad. I got my shirt in the way because it's warm today, as every day. Uh, I got to get my uh, friend Dimitri. He's a he's a computer technician. I'm gonna get him to work on my laptop. I seem to be having a little trouble with it. Anyway, we have these antique bamboo chairs. They're hand carved, very beautiful. There's a set of them. Here's the other one over here. And uh, oh, a bunch of snacks. Shampoo, detergent, crackers, coffee. And my junk table with my medicine on it. Plenty of coffee and hand sanitizer. But yeah, my place is small, but it's not too bad. It's all I need. Got a little closed off bedroom here. Got me a double mat. Cameras want to act funny, ceiling fan. But it's just a simple. Filipino apartment we Got the dirty kitchen outside. It's what we call a dirty kitchen um, Because it's Open the rain can't get in but No animals can get in either or people but It's got one wall open to the jungle and of course it's got the CR in here too, the toilet, and the floor is wet right now. I was cleaning up. Took me a semi-quick bath to cool off, and uh, just bathed right there by the toilet. Used the bucket to, and the dipper to dump the water over you. We used to do when we were kids in the country. And of course, that's the outside, the kitchen, gas stove. And in the back over here, there is a fired kitchen. And it's got a couple of spaces to build a fire and cook with. And this is the other dirty kitchen. This is the, the landlord's dirty kitchen. We can use it for the, for the store and to cook groceries. And of course the landlord's house and the daughters are nurses. That's their house. And the other side over there is the jungle. And they have a little sewing room here. And then here's the store. And we're going to build it back up. As soon as this crisis is over. I don't know when. But... Uh, seems like uh, there's a lot of people dying. And our prayers go out to y'all. Really sorry about this whole deal, but you know, when you got a, uh, governments and everything, and anyway, I don't even want to talk about that. So there's my little apartment. I hope you liked it. And uh, Teresa, dear. You wanted to see my apartment, here it is. And I think I'm gonna stay here a while because everything in here belongs to me. And uh I don't have to leave. 
If somebody don't want to stay here with me, then they're welcome to hit the door and take their stuff with them and leave my stuff here because I've closed out two other houses in my time and y'all have seen them on the videos if y'all watch my videos um me and the first girlfriend june lynn i don't know she she run off now i hear she's pregnant with a baby by a police officer and a neighbor that lives there had told me that she was running back to that police officer and so that's old news and then here uh, a couple months ago me and Fatima broke up she uh she decided she wanted to date more than one man so I just packed up my clothes and left everything and moved down here So, I met this new little girl. She's 21, same age as Fatima. She, uh, she's very sweet. She's from Manila. Matter of fact, she's just outside of Manila and Manila's on lockdown right now. They're not letting anybody in or out of the city. And, you know, it's a, that's a sad thing going on here, people. But we have to remember to take care of one another because if we don't take care of one another, the government's sure not going to take care of you. They're going to deal with you, and you may not like the way they deal with you. I know I've seen some harsh, harsh videos from China, which aren't too pretty. But anyway, I wanted to show y'all my apartment. And coming soon, I hope, after everything straightens back out, we're gonna open the Gong Gong store. Well, I'm gonna close this video out. I just wanted to show y'all my apartment, let y'all know what's going on, give you a little update. Uh, me and June Lynn and me and Fatima still talk. Of course, you know, it's not cordial. And, uh, Anyway, um, we still get along. We're still friends. If anything bad should happen to either one of them, I would, I would help them. And I feel like if I got sick, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure Fatima would come help me. Or if something bad happened, if I needed help, I'm, I'm sure I could get the help I needed here. And Zai, my little girlfriend Manila, Hopefully, sometimes it's noisy here and you have to scream over the traffic. But anyway, hopefully, um, she'll be here next month. And we'll start, start working on the store and getting everything together. But anyway, I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, show y'all a few pictures of Zai at the end of this video. So watch the end of the video and Wish my granddaughter a happy birthday and I hope she lives to be a hundred years old. She had a wonderful time talking to me and uh, talked to my grandson on uh, video chat. And it must be getting close to lunchtime because the traffic is getting bad. I don't even know what time it is. Anyway, y'all, y'all have a good day today and be safe out there. And remember, wash your hands. 
try not to buy up all the toilet paper and anything in the grocery store because it's, you know, the world's not coming to an end, at least for the majority of us. So let's, let's take care of one another and be calm out there, people. And watch the, watch the end of the video. I'll show you some pictures. Good day.